Hi and welcome to another video by me, Flojo. Today we're going to be looking at the URI host function on Power Automate. But before we get started, we need to understand what a host is. So, let's say we've got this URL. It's a full link to a particular blog post on flojo.io. Well, the host is the actual website, which is www.flojo.io. Now, maybe you want to just provide the website to someone in an email rather than provide a full link, or you maybe want to customize a link outside of the link you've received. Well, how do you do this then? Firstly, what you would want to do is you would want to pass the URL into the URI host function. This will then return us the www.flojo.io host. So let's see this on Power Automate then. Okay, so we're on Power Automate and we've got a manual trigger for our flow and we've got a compose, which is our web URL link. And then we have got another compose, which we are calling the URI host function and passing in the link to it. So let's kick off our flow and see what we get back. Okay, so from our actual initial link, which contains path parameters, it contains the host, etc., we have taken the www.flojo.io host out of that, and then we can pass that and use that however we want to. And that is how you use URI host on Power Automate. That's it from me, Flojo. Check out my blog at flojo.io for more guides on the Power Platform, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.